100% Chelsea. Chelsea lost 2-1 at Old Trafford. Jay, mate. Uh, nightmare. It's just individual incompetence, and that's a big word, but you got. I, I, there's not much I can say. It's just a lack of individuals not performing on this is if not the biggest the, if not one of the biggest the biggest stage we can form on maybe not in terms of league positions right now but every time we play against Man United it's without a doubt one of the biggest if not the biggest game of the season and in terms of what it meant to us today in terms of how both teams needed the three points as much of each other we didn't really look like we wanted it at all maybe the first what 20-25 minutes I don't know when the William goal was scored it was somewhat in the summer first half but we should have seen that out we really should have seen that out we should have at least went into half time with a 1-0 lead we can buck up our ideas and come out and do what we know we could do best but <laughs> the old cheeky sport uh, they're so loud oh dearie 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 But this is this is what it means. This is what it means. This is what it sees. It's, it's, it sees us in a glum mood and them in a in a whatever that was. But I'm just gonna say it now. Murat Art is embarrassing. Yes. At times he is an embarrassment to watch in this club because this whole falling down thing. People have said, oh, it's just because he comes from Spain. Fuck that. I don't I, I don't take that as an excuse for the way he plays because he played in Spain. First of all, I'm pretty sure he played in Italy more than he played in Spain. And you didn't see that from him when he was playing for Juventus. He was a good hold-up striker who knew how to finish his chances when he got the when he got the when he got the ball. He knew where to put himself when he didn't have the ball. And <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go on. We just don't see that from the Chelsea rat, and I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like the same thing again. What I said with Bakayoko, if it's a confidence thing, or whether he just doesn't want to play for us. Because for seventy million pounds, you should be getting much better a return from a striker of that caliber. Because the thing is, we're not. I'm not doubting that he's not a good striker. I'm not doubting that he can't do the job. But for us, he just doesn't do it, and I just don't know the reason why. But anyway, that's enough said about Morata. He's not the striker we need at the moment. Whether Giroud is the striker we need at the moment, that's a different question and there's only one way to find out and that's playing him but Moses incompetent is the word I'm going to use again because the amount of times he got into such great positions and then it's like he doesn't know what to do with it it's like his brain just decides to go Woo, I'm going to go away and my, your feet are just not going to do what I'm going to tell you to do because it just seems like he just doesn't know what he's doing he gets past players and we're like yes Moses go on go on and then it's just oh and it's not like it happens once it doesn't happen twice it happens every single time he gets in a good position I think maybe about once or twice out of about several times he could have done something good he only did it once and it's just disappointing I think the only player I'm going to point out who had a somewhat positive performance was Drinkwater and I know he's probably not going to get as much credit as, gonna, as he deserves but he was probably the only one who I thought was doing at least something whether that was enough or not, that's a different question but he feels like the only player who was doing something the defence again somewhat solid but then again somewhat shaky and I just feel like that's because there's a lot of changes going to our back three it seems like every game I think it's like only I don't know how many times we start with the same back three, but it seems we're always chopping and changes because we just don't know what our best team is. We don't know what our best back line is. We don't know what our best formation is. <sighs> Out of the top four now, it's a real battle. The rest of the season, we just got to stay positive. We know we can do it, but whether we will... It's another question, isn't it? It's another question, and that's for another day. But yeah, anyways, incompetent performance. We didn't deserve to win, and we're out of top four now, so... <sighs> Yay! <laughs>